Adventures of Kraskarek. Welcome back to the Adventures of Kraskarek. It is again I, Kraskarek, as we continue our adventures in Atlas Modded. Now, today I'm sailing across the ocean, uh, continuing my search for the gold, ancient gold miles. And while I'm doing so, I'm picking up treasure, you know, avoiding some enemies and stuff like that. And you got to find ways to pass the time. So I start to tell a few of my stories of my adventures and experiences in Atlas to kind of help you, the viewer, kind of prepare yourself for some of the stuff you might run into. And even talk a bit about my plans of how to deal with a gold mile. So let's take a look. Now, let's continue our plan to conquer the world now. Oh, don't tell me it's it's not erasing what I've done, is it? Alright, let's see. Uh, I think I'm going to have to have some sort of a system here. I haven't found a golden isle yet. At least it's remembering where I've been up to a point. We can go down to and see if we find a golden isle. Alright. Let's get everyone in place, yo. Oh, um. <laughs> now, are we all repaired, sir? Let's check downstairs. Oh, she's still repairing, so everything's fine. Alright, let's get rolling. Uh, we got a 7,000 buff. We are good. We're going to head south to the next two zones, maybe. Alright. I don't know. Let's see if we can catch this. Can we do this? Ah, uh. oh, I missed it. Oh well. Would have been cool. Oh! Enemy ships. Nope. Ever since they changed things, like, there's no way I'm going to survive against a fleet like that. Nah, hell no. <clears throat> now you're probably thinking, oh, I want to see you fight ships. Yeah, sure. Then it gets sunk. Then it's going to take me 48 hours, well, it'll take me about 24 hours without sleep or, or breaks to uh, rebuild the ship. But then to have to crew it again would take uh, some more time because I'd have to go out and buy more crew. Um, I'd also have lost all my money, so I'd have to do all the treasure hunts all over again with a smaller crew. It, it's a mess. Top side, oh my goodness. All right, what do we got? Uh, nope, not a gold isle, okay. Well, I say we scoot around this island and keep heading south, because I doubt these things are going to have anything different, anything different from what I've already seen. No, no! Oh, they got me surrounded! Okay. It's okay, just get your bearings. You gotta go through here, man. You're gonna thread the needle. Oh, God. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. They're going to be close enough if they turn around. There you go. You're just going to scoot right on past the island here, okay? That's what we're going to do. We're going to be fine. Full speed. <clears throat> I hope I don't hit shallows. I'm going to hit shallows. Oh, shit. They're forcing me into engagement. No! Oh, shit. It's close enough to fire. Oh no, there it goes. You know what? Run! Run! Oh my god! Ah! Oh god! Roll, roll, repair, repair! Where's my kit? Oh jeez! Ah! Oh god! Come on, come on, we gotta get down there. Oh my god, no, no, no. Um, alright, alright. It looks like the cannon fire stopped. We're gonna have to repair. Oh my god. I might have just lost them, let's see. Holy hell, yeah, get the hell out of here. Alright, so clearly on this block is not a golden aisle. We're gonna go dip into F11. 
wonder. Nah, it's gonna be too bad. Do you mind? Hey. Maybe if we pull up over here. Got it? Good, let's take off. We gotta head back south. There you go. And maybe, third time's the charm. Got it! Yeah! Yeah! Awesome! <clears throat> ah, very nice. What else? Excuse me? Yeah, why don't you just click it? Oh, I don't get that. Perfect. Down. Ooh, a whale. I think it's a blue whale, so I think I should be okay. I'm going to hunt one at, at some point, but i got to be careful because I have had some crazy blue whale stories, dude. Or, or in this game. Like, I... One time I hunted... A whale and and the damn thing turned to face me and then it dove into the water I'm like oh no well where is it and I'm like circling around and it finally came up from below rams into the bottom of my ship destroys the bottom two floors and I'm like oh my god the ship's sinking almost immediately and I remember we all splashed out of the water all my crew my bear at the time and I was like oh god what do we do I'm about to hit the zone line and so what happened was we're swimming there frantically, and all of a sudden they hear a guy go, Ah! And I look around, and a shark pulls a guy under, and I'm like, Oh my god! Oh my god! Get it. And I look around there, and there's my rowboat, and I hear, Ah! Oh! I'm like, Oh god, oh god! I got up onto the boat, and I'm like, Quick! Quick! You know, tell my bear, Get on the boat! Instead, all the crew fight each other trying to climb onto the boat, and I'm like, No! Get off! Get off! It's mine! It's mine! So I, I made them all get off the boat. And then I brought the bear onto the boat, on a little rowboat, and freaking people are still dying and stuff. And we start sailing off. I'm like, ah, ha, ha, screw you guys, screw you guys. It's just me and Barrington. We're gonna make it. And then I see the whale came back around. It was waiting the whole time. It came right up to our boat, turned around, and tail slapped, smashing our rowboat, sending us into the water. I'm swimming like crazy, and all, and I hear the last of the people get eaten by the sharks behind me. And then I turn around and I see them start devouring my bear. I was like, oh god, no, please, no, oh god. And it freaking, they kill the bear and I poke my head under the water and I see like eight, nine sharks all bumping into each other going for me. And they were just, oh god, it was a nightmare. That was the worst. I was like, oh dude, I'm never going to let a whale catch me. No, screw that, screw that. And there was another time that I went whale hunting. I was playing with my girlfriend. This was a while back. Oop, there's an enemy ship. I gotta get around it. Oh, is it? It's not a golden isle. It could be. Don't know. Nah, it's too small of an isle. But nonetheless, I better head to it to get some supplies. So anyway, this other time I was whale hunting. I had my girlfriend playing with me. And we started firing on this whale. And it actually went full speed and rammed its nose into the side of our ship, which destroyed the back half of the top two parts of the top two floors. And I got thrown like like a football field away from the uh, the ship. And I was like, oh my god, you know? And I'm swimming because I'm like, oh god, don't think about the sharks, just go. And I'm yelling at my girlfriend, stop the boat, stop the boat. She didn't know how. I said, just jump off, the, the NPCs will stop it. She, uh, Cause she was saying the steering wheel was gone. I'm like, oh my god! So she jumped off. I caught up to the boat. I climb up. There's no mid floor or bottom. 
there was literally a hole going all the way down. Like, almost the bottom of the ship was still intact, so it wasn't sinking yet. But the top two floors were destroyed and the side. So I, I immediately jumped in there, grabbed some debris, and I crafted a workbench, slapped it at the bottom of the ship. And in the workbench, I got the debris and I built a steering wheel, went up, found some, whatever was left at the top of the deck and just stuck the wheel, the wheel down and steered that thing, crashed, and I beached it onto the nearby island. And we crashed it right into the shallows there, just like right there. And I turn around and the whale comes up like a drive-by and slowly swims right by us. And then it turns and goes back off in the ocean. I was like, whoa, screw that. I mean, honestly, when I first started playing Atlas, my first day of playing Atlas years and years ago, I, uh, I, I had literally on my raft leaving the noob zone, I crossed the, the border. And as soon as I crossed, there were dolphins. I jumped in the water to say hi to the dolphins, and a sperm whale came up from the depths. Dark mass, opened its jaws, and, and bit me, and almost killed me in one bite, and bumped the raft. And I jumped on the raft sail right back to the noob zone. That was the only time in this game I've ever seen a sperm whale, which is supposed to be the aggressive whales. But the trouble I've had with my ship is blue whales. So I'm hoping one day to get them. I've got a bunch of... Um, as you can see, Ballista on the back. So when I'm ready, I'll just take all my crew, the three up front, the two in the back, and have them man those things. But what I want to do is I want to make sure my ship's upgraded a bit to be a lot faster. I want to get it up to like 14, I don't know if it'll get to 15 knots with my current loadout. I'd probably have to lose a lot of weight. But I'm just going to keep upgrading the weight till it can handle it. And uh, hopefully that'll improve the speed and make sure that I can outrun these things. And then I might go, then I'll probably go away then. So, man, this is fun, though. But yeah, so my plan is I want to find a gold Nile, right? And what I want to do is I, uh, if it's the Hydra, which I've encountered before, the plan is I'm going to go into the ancient ruins where it's at. I'm going to climb up a building, like maybe one or two of them. I'm going to build a bunch of chests. Then I'm going to start stockpiling guns and ammo and any kind of ranged weapons, whatever. And I'm just going to go back and forth on my ship, go into another zone, build up resources, keep bringing it back and load those chests up. So when I go to fight this thing, I'll have tons of ammo and guns and things to replace it. But I'm going to need to make uh, probably shotguns and other stuff because I know that you have to go to the cave afterwards in order to turn it in. And that's going to be a pain, because those creatures are, like, almost invincible. So even if you defeat the boss, getting into the cave and through it to turn in the gem and get the, uh, the, uh, Fountain of Youth, yeah, that's going to be hard. Grape Shop, remove the mobs in the caves. There are no mobs in the caves anymore? Oh! <laughs> Oh god, you mean we can actually go in? And we can actually just walk in there and not get jumped by bats and snakes and undead that keep you from even... Oh my god. So you can actually just go straight to... Oh, Jesus. You can go straight and turn in the, uh, the gem and get the, uh, Fountain of Youth with no interruptions? <gasps> Perfect! Oh, great, so the... Good, good, that's... That's... That's wonderful. Oh my god, I'm so happy. So all I gotta focus now is on defeating the boss. Oh my god, that's such a relief. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you again next time on the Adventures of Crash Correct.